Okay, we're doing this again. If I have to suffer through Steam's recent release page to find some gem, maybe perhaps one day, then you have to too. Let's get to it. Shelter in the Doomsday. Survival 2D platformer? Mainly focused on the death mushroom. That shouldn't be happening. Okay, kind of retro, but I can get into it. What else is happening besides stabbing bats? And it's in Japanese, bye! Ryo, it's in Japanese. Hippo. Hippo? It's barely loading. Hippo. Looks like a JRPG. And a bad one. Rapis the Bullets. 2D scrolling shooter. Not my kind. Speedmaster. Very retro graphics. Kind of fast, but kind of bad controls. So, do not have this close of a camera for games like this. This is horrible. It's On Totus. Uh huh. Horror game. Still no gameplay. Yeah, very, very horror. And that's pretty much it. Was it Chimera? Oh, it's VR and it's jittery as hell. Vox Populi Poland 2023. Grand strategy? I really don't know. Political simulator? Political sim. I should read the tags. After University, Interactive Fiction, Immersive Sim. No, it's jittery as hell. Lovey Dovey, another stupid horror game. Again, just random titles make no sense. And it looks really bad. 69 toilets, thank you. I need that. Deadly Rain, really, really dark survival FPS. And shooting looks bad. Yeah, Windrider, JRPG. Ninth Sentinel Sisters. Bullet Heaven? Or oh, something else? I'm not really sure. It doesn't look like a, exactly a 2D scroller. Oh, and it's very animated. Armchair Commander. No, I hate those games. Like turn based strategy, but not really polished in any way. Also, I don't do the sex games, so you're welcome. Ghost at Dawn. Uh, another very dark horror like thing. Survival horror. And Alone in the Dark was a while ago. Get over it. Fake way. It's in Japanese. The Castle Mystery. I like the music. It actually looks like it plays nice. It's really dark though. It's too dark. You know, not really my thing, but if you're into atmospheric horror walking simulators, looks nice. Red barrels go boom. I can guess what this is. Bullets are useless? Oh no, come on, not this. Oh, you have to get them to the red barrel and then explode it. No, that's boring. The UI looks horrible. Saw that online. Yeah, I know it's loved, but it's in Japanese. I don't play it. Jumpman. Another very minimalistic marble game. Robot? What? Role-playing adventure puzzle game? So far, it's boring and there's nothing to hear. Okay, this is Core Decay. I've put this here even though I know about it, because it looks awesome. It's by 3D Realms, it's still not out, but it looks to be like it's really trying to channel Deus Ex and System Shock 2. I'm not gonna play the whole trailer, you watch it yourself, because it really uh, shows this. And it's by Slipgate, actually. Slipgate are the people from uh, Ghost Runner, which is really cool. I'm really looking forward to this one. Okay, it's in Japanese, and it looks like a sex game. Monos, The Endless Tower. Is this a climbing game? Is this a survival game? Is this a... Is this a Plants vs. Zombies game? What the hell is going on here? It's supposed to be tower defense, but... With an actual tower. <laughs> Good one. Good one. Mechanization. Factory building game. Casual? Idol? Well... There's barely any gameplay here. And it doesn't look very good. Yeah. Traincraft. Another train sim? Looks like a train sim. They didn't mention train sim. They should add a train sim tag. No. Idle blocks. What what are we doing with these blocks? We're clicking the blocks and gaining stuff. And the UI looks horrible. Space Shooter 24. I would give you more time because I like space shooters, but the trailer is giving me a headache already. Realm of Dread. Okay, it's not really dark for what is probably a horror game. Okay, now it's really dark. Now it's really, really dark. Uh, yuck. I know when it's dark, it's really, really dark, but this is a game. Riley in the Abyss. Oh, it's a really, really retro game, and it looks like the frame rate is really low. Livestream 2? This is in Japanese. 
And I think that's enough for now. Join me next time for another critiquing Steam pages where I force you to watch really horrible games. Bye-bye. <laughs>